Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Building with Sausage. This is Mythical Sausage here. Hello, what is up everybody man? We are back again here in our tutorial world. About to do another village upgrade transformation. And it's, it's looking really, really cool. We got almost that whole side over here completely done. We got a little bit left to go. And I'm so excited to keep building up in here. Man, it is, we've been doing some good stuff. But if you guys want to check out any of the previous builds we have behind us, there's a link in the description. Go check it out. It's a bunch of cool peruse, browse through. And we got some really cool ones and we're also using our boy jersey boys pack and if you guys want to check out that pack it's amazing it's my favorite vanilla of all and it's just recently updated you can check it out in the description as well there's a little link down there all right now let's start with this beautiful tiny little house and i want to build a little bit of a farmhouse because we have it really really close to the crops that are right here. This lovely crop field, man, I love it. I love it, it and we have a house right next to it. So I'm thinking about maybe making this into like a little farmhouse so you can have the person who actually tends to this farm, the farmer, hang out, live here, and maybe have a little extra storage for uh, for whatever is going on in this farm. All right, cool, so let's start building. I'm gonna flip, I'm gonna change this thing. Let's transform this little guy. now. First thing I want to do is I want to change the wood type. So I'm going with dark oak logs. I'm going to bring some spruce in here, uh, some stripped oak wood as well, some hay bales for the roof, and then a little bit of the stone brickage and some cobblestone. But let's start this up right now okay so first off let's get rid of this roof because why do you have all these this thing here this is so weird uh and let's get rid of all this all this here and boom okay so first off i want to get rid of these corners so i'm gonna go straight down with oak uh, i mean the uh, dark oak <laughs> right here so it's just gonna go from bottom to top so one two three four uh i think four is fine four <laughs> now let's go over here on this side let's go ahead and replace these and we're gonna go ahead and replace these. So simple as that, just getting rid of those logs, making them a little darker, looking very nice. Look at that, okay. Now, next up, let's get rid of that thing. I don't know what that's doing. Okay, now, uh, what I wanna do is down here, I wanna do um, keeping this cobble and stuff like that, but I wanna bring in a little stone and I wanna bring it up a little bit. Let's bring it up by two. Just like this, so stone. We're gonna put the door back in here, but I'll leave it right there, that's fine. We're gonna leave the door right where it is. Uh, and then over here, it's gonna lift this up. Maybe bring in some of that. There we go, texture it up a little bit. Take that out, let's go like this. There we go, and then do another one. Maybe one more there, that looks good. Uh, and then get rid of that, and let's bring some more stone, and maybe one like that. Perfect, okay. Now, let's get rid of this, this, and that. Let's get rid of all of this oak that we see here right now like this perfect oh wait i broke something i was supposed to and we're back okay <laughs> so we're going up right here i'm gonna go up by two so now let's make a little entrance to this but i want to do like a little tiny porch so this is what i want to do we're gonna go out by one two and three and then drop it right there a little log so one two and three right here at the edges okay let's take it up by two actually right there perfect and then i'm gonna go ahead and bring this cobble and stone just down like so but just one level just one like that then let's switch some stone and some cobble like this and boom perfect and then let's just mess around put coal a cobble and stone something like that perfect all right so we have this little walkway uh i'm gonna seal off this side so let's grab a fence i'm gonna go with uh, let's do a dark oak fence and let's go ahead and do a little uh, side here, a little side thing here. And then we're only going to have the way in right here. So actually, let's take these three out and let's put a little stair going up. Actually, let's do a little cobble mixture as well. Uh, like that. Okay, perfect. So that's your way in right here. Lovely. I love it so much. Okay, now let's actually lift this up again by one more. So there's a total of five right there. And let's cross beam right here. Cross beam here cross beam right here and a little cross beam right there perfecto now let's grab this stripped oak wood and we're just gonna go up like that simple just go all the way up don't worry about the windows for now let's go all the way up like this all the way up here and here and then on this one uh let's grab a spruce there and put it right there i like that i like that look very cool very nice okay now next up uh, I'm gonna go and start working on a little bit of a roof, but this is how we're gonna do it. Uh, first off, I'm gonna do like a little overhang that goes from here to here down, that swoops in. Then we're gonna go ahead and do a nice little peaked roof on this side, and then over here, I wanna do a nice little overhang also to do like a storage uh, on this side. So let's do that first, uh, the storage here. Uh, so I'm gonna take a space of right here, this is a one, a two, and a three. So technically, yeah, one, two, three from here. Let's go ahead and drop this dark oak. And we're gonna go up by one, two, three only, okay? So one, two, three, like that. 
Okay, leave that there, perfect. Now, we're gonna grab uh, the stone and the cobble mixture like we did last time, and do the same thing over here, just mixing it up like that, very nice. And then we're gonna also do it uh, right about here as well. Now, let's cross beam right there, okay? Now, let's also do, let's mix this up a little more, uh, something like that. Okay, let's lift that as well. One more up on this side, one more up on this side, and then let's actually, for now, let's just leave that like this okay leave it like that you'll see okay leave it there <laughs> now you, don't you touch that okay you ready okay cool now <laughs> let's grab our uh dark uh no a regular spruce okay and then we're gonna go from here we're gonna go one two three four five and one is six and over here is seven okay seven like that perfect now we're gonna go up right here up by one now let's do a uh gonna go with a simple stair going up uh, I really wanted to make it a little taller, but every stair is normal, so we're not gonna go with no fantasy. We're going straight, regular old medieval, just like that. Now, let's take it up again, up again, and this is the middle. Let's go upside down stair, stair facing that way, and then we're gonna go back down this direction, like so, and then we're gonna stop right there, just like this. Now, let's keep going over here. So we're gonna go up like this, stair, stair, and we're gonna go back down. I'm stuck, I'm fine now. I'm um, no, I'm not, I'm fine now. Okay, and we're gonna keep going down like so and meet up right there. Perfect. Okay, now I wanna do a little something right here. So this is looking very cool and I also wanna fill this in. But first off, let's do this uh, let's, let's do this connection that I wanna do. So for now, I wanna do this. Let's go with a uh, slab. And I'm gonna put a slab row right here like this and pop it out one on each side like that. Also wanna take it down one lower, take it down like this, take it all the way down one more on each side. We're gonna go up one more here like that. And then we're gonna connect that in there. Okay, let's do it again over here. So we're gonna go bum, bum, and bum right there. And then connect all of these together. Uh, let's see, let's do, you know what? Let's connect that here. Let's take it one up, connect this over. On this one, I'm gonna take up one more cobble or let's mix in some of the stone in there. Perfect, let's take it up a stone, there we go. Uh, let's see, that's enough cobble, that's perfect. And then I'm gonna take down, all the way down that stair that we have, but we have this nice little overhang that went down like that. I love that, That look, that's looking very cool. Now, uh, I wanna bring in the hay bales now. I'm gonna do them facing, facing down like this, and we're gonna put them all the way down like this. Uh, over here, let's do it again. It's a placeholder block, place, let's do placeholder blocks down here. I'm gonna take them out in a second, and we're gonna just take that down like so. Okay, let's do it again. So this is perfect, going straight down here. Let's do placeholder block again. And then we'll take them out in a second. Those are just placeholders, take them all the way down. And then let's go inside and get rid of those placeholder blocks. So all of that and all of those. Perfecto. And then over here, I'm just gonna go ahead and bring this guy all the way down like so. So to this way, to this way, and a full block in the middle like that. Perfect. That's looking so cool. I love hay bale blocks looking like that. That is so nice. Okay, well, you know what? We could take it down one more here, though. Let's see, let's see what it looks like. Uh, I'm gonna probably do some placeholder blocks right there for a second. Let's see what it looks like. You know what? It looks good there, but over here is not gonna look good. We could even, hold on. Let's see what this looks like. Just out of curiosity, we could take that all the way down like that and then have this a two and have this like that. Ooh, let's see what it looks like. Let's get rid of these placeholders. You know what? I am a fan. Let me, oh, sorry. I took that out by mistake. Uh, I'm a fan. So let's take that lower and then let's leave those on the other side regular. I think that's very cool. So it doesn't have to be symmetrical. So we got that going down, dip down like this. And then we have this one over here like that. Oh, I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Okay, Nan. Okay, <laughs> cool. Now, let's keep this up. Let's keep this up. Now, let's get rid of these other placeholders. I forgot to take those out. Get rid of those placeholders. Okay. Now, in here, in the middle, uh, I want to change it up. Let's bring in some dark oak. Uh, regular dark oak. How about... Hmm. Let's see. Stripped. Let's see what, what looks better. A stripped it looks... Um... Now, I'm going to go with straight dark oak. Oh, but it looks too similar. You know what? Let's go with this. Uh, hmm. Let's go with the stripped. Let's go with the stripped right here. Oh, I like that. All right, let's go with the stripped inside. Right here, here, and there. So stripped dark oak right inside there. That looks very, very cool. I love it. Okay, now 
Let, let's work on now this little section. So I did want to do a little overhang here, but let's see what it would look like. Um, so if I grab a wall, let's grab a cobble wall. Let's drop a cobble wall here and here. Now, let's see what this would look like. If I do grab this and take it up at an angle, let's go up right here. Now we're gonna go up there, up there, and that meets up here. Let's check this out. So bum, bum, there we go. And then if this comes over, that looks good actually. And then we could probably seal that up right there. And I am loving that right there. Let's come inside, let's check this out from underneath here. We can get rid of that. Take these out, take that little upside down stair up, take it down by two. Oh baby, uh, that is awesome. I'm not gonna even mess with that. That looks cool. Uh, yeah, I'm not gonna even touch, that's perfect. Let's leave that just like that and this looks awesome in the inside, right there, perfect. Nice, all right, uh, all right, let's keep this up. Now, we're gonna add some details on the outside though. Uh, first thing I wanna do is let's come in here, uh, let's put in a window right over Ooh, let's see. I'm gonna put a window. Let's put a window right over here. Let's put one single window right there. I'm gonna put upside down stand. The window is here. Back here, you know what? Let's add a cool uh, little, uh, like a fireplace right there will look good. Uh, on this side, I'm not gonna add any windows. We have this, so we have a little door to get in here. Let's knock this all out. I'm gonna block this in with some cobble and some stone mixture right there. Put a little out, little section out there. It's like an outhouse. No, we're not gonna poop in there. Uh, we're gonna put storage. But back here, let's bring in, Jeremy has uh, updated this pack to have some really sexy bricks. So let's go over here and grab some bricks. And there's a couple different bricks. There's our regular bricks we have right there. Regular stone brick stairs here, but look at the red sandstone. Doesn't that look nice? And also the red nether brick. Let's come inside with this real fast. Uh, let's also grab a wall. I'm gonna put this as a tippy to tip. And let's come right in here. So I'm gonna knock this one down right there. Let's go ahead and then come in here with regular brick. I'm gonna go uh, right here. Let's go up one, two, three, four, five, six. Let's knock this and this down. Let's knock this down as well. So let's count again. This is one, two, three, four, five, six. Let's go seven, eight, nine. Let's go nine. And let's go in here too, uh, right about at this level. Uh, and then I could work with something right here. I could put like a little upside down stair and we can have like a little um, fireplace action right there. But I will bring this back up. So that is, let's count again. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So a nine. And then on the top, let's go ahead. I'm gonna put these two right there, perfect. And then over here, let's actually mess around with this. Let's change some of these to the nether brick. See how it's a little brighter red tint to it. Like that, that looks very cool. And maybe pepper in a little bit of the red brick right there. Oh, that looks nice, just a little bit. And that gives it a cool texture, I love that. I love that so much. Now, down here, we could bring in maybe a couple of these. Let's lift this up by two on each side. And then how about we grab just uh, the stairs of your bricks and go like this. Maybe drop this down, maybe one more, and let's go like that. Oh, that's awesome. That's really cool. Okay, I'm in love. Now, that's all. I'm not gonna really mess with this too much. That looks very cool, and a top part like that. Perfect little farmhouse. I'm loving this thing. Now, another thing that I wanted to add is when we come inside, let's separate this right here. So let's change this floor up right here. So I'm gonna just bring in bricks and cobble. So it's nice and quaint and little, <laughs> but we could do some stuff. So how about we grab some trap door, and I'm gonna go ahead just with the spruce trap door, and I'm gonna lay down a little level right here, right about, oh, let's put them all at the same angle, like that. Let's put a ladder on here on the side, just so we can have a little space to get up. So right, bum, bum, bum. And then boom, we have this little area right here. I said you take that up on that side, this side's fine. Uh, on the top here, we could just put a row of trapdoor. And let's put a bed. Let's do quick interior action. Let's go with the green bed, that looks very cool. Uh, actually, I'm gonna have to do this, just a placeholder block. Uh, let's put a bed. Now let's get rid of that. And then we can come back up here and lay down the same trap doors we had. Hold on, bum, bum, perfect. Uh, come back up, there we go. So let's grab a chest. I'm gonna drop a chest. Let's drop one right here in this corner like, uh, like that. Let's grab a painting. Painting, oh, it looks so nice right there. Bum, perfect. Oh, oh no, that's a pot and paint, I love that one. Oh, there we go. 
Uh, then I will put maybe over here an armor stand. Let's drop the armor stand. Let's also do a little book shelf action. There we go. Let's drop a little armor stand. I'm gonna do one right there. We can drop a little bookshelf right there. Let's put a uh, fl put a flower pot. We drop a little flower pot. Get a little flower action. Maybe one of those. I love that one. That's so nice. Bam bam. Then we can do a little carpet right here. Arp. No carpet. <laughs> Let's do. Uh, how about a little purple carpet? Why not? Why not? There we go. Boom. Look how cool. And you know what else? Look at this. Uh, what is the redstone torch? Where is it? Redstone what? torch? Where's the redstone torch? Did they change it? Hold on. There it is. It's called a candle now. Look how cool this looks. Um, look at that. It doesn't really emit that much light, but that is a cool new feature. Look at that, a redstone torch on Jeremy Pack. So cool. You can add a regular torch if you want, but something like that looks very, very cool. And we're done. We're done with this little part. Now, down here, make it something very, very simple. Uh, let's grab some furnace. I will drop maybe one furnace right there. Let's grab a slab of the brick, and I will put that, like, right there. That's perfect. Uh, let's grab a cauldron. Uh, drop a little cauldron action probably right here. Uh, maybe this side. Yeah, this side will look a little better. Uh, let's grab a crafting bench. And to make it very survival friendly too, we can put some stuff like this. Uh, look at this painting. See if I can grab the good painting. The one that's with the, that has the pasta pants. Look at that. That's so cool. So cool. I love it, Jerem. Very nice. Uh, over here, let's grab some stairs. And I'm going to go ahead and do... Let's do regular... How about acacia? Acacia right here, one right here, a little fence post action. Let's go with a birch, why not? Uh, let's put that there, a little pressure plate on top. And, oh, we got all the color pressure plates. Let's do, um, let's bring, you know, one acacia too. Let's look and match that, look at that. And then we can just put, I don't know, a simple item frame will look nice, I think. And the item frame right there, not there, there and there. Uh, let's see, we can even put a little one right there and maybe, on the tippy top, what can we put? Let's grab, I don't know, let's put some food. Let's put a, uh, I don't know, a little por a raw pork chop or something. Let's put a little raw pork chop right there. Perfect. <laughs> that's awesome. Uh, I think that's pretty good. We can add another painting maybe on this corner. Uh, there, something like that. And then we do need to put a window. So how about getting a really cool glass? Uh, let's put a light blue. I don't know, I haven't used light blue in a while. Perfect. Uh, and then a little carpet action, maybe a little orange might look okay. Right there in this corner, just a little orange right there. Maybe getting rid of this one and putting one thing like that. There we go! Super simple, but super awesome. I love this thing, this looks super cool. Uh, if you want, if you really want to add a torch instead of the candle, uh, you can go ahead and put something like that. Or you could just go down here, put some glowstone. It don't matter, have fun with it. And then we got boop and boop. There we go! Maybe a little something like that. <laughs> awesome. Now, for doors. Let's see. Uh, so many cool new doors. You know what? How about we use an acacia door? Why not? Let's see what the acacia one looks like. Oh, wow. Yes. That looks awesome. Uh, and then maybe out here we can drop some of these candles so you can see how it looks awesome on the outside. It doesn't really emit that much light, but it does look cool. Look at that. That's awesome. Now, for this little piece, let's grab another door. Door. Uh, let's go with acacia again. Why not? And then over here, just, this will be your storage. This will be your storage. So let's go with some chests. Uh, let's go with ender chests. Let's go with crafting tables. Let's go with a bunch of stuff. So we can do a little storage here. Where did my chest go? <laughs> it's gone. All right, there we go. Maybe a little double chest action. Yeah. Hello. That fell. Um, how about, no, how about we do something like this? Bam. Make it look cool. We can even add a couple. Can you open that? No, you can't. Um, you can't do nothing up here. So, you know what? I would just seal this off. I will go like boop, boop, and poop. There we go. Uh, and maybe a couple more like right over here. Double chest. And then maybe a little ender right there. Uh, over here, you can even add maybe a couple separate ones there. And we can even do the trap door as a little way to hold that up. Nice. And you can still do the little glowstone trick if you want and put a little carpet on the bottom and you are good to go. Let's do a little blue carpet. Bam. Perfect. That's all there is to it. Look at that. Nice. You can even throw a, a painting in there if you want. Look how pretty. A little painting right there. 
<laughs> nice, even a little item frame. And then you can add uh, anything in here really on this item frame. Maybe even a, a lead if you have a little horsey or something. Drop it in there, perfect. So that's it, that's your little storage right here on the outside. Oh, oh man, look at this. If you really wanted to, you can even extend this in the inside part and maybe knock this wall down and you have that whole extra section if you don't want to have like an outdoor storage. And if you're going to do that, you can make this into like a little window. Uh, but so many options, so many different things you could do. Now, you can still go at it. If you want to do stuff like we did over here on this side where I added uh, these little supports, and it's almost like a theme of this area to add these little, little things here. Let me show you. Uh, if you want to keep with this theme, if not, we're done. We're completely finished. But if you want to stick uh, around for a second and check this out, uh, you can add a couple little bits of detail over here. Uh, maybe grab a stair. There we go. And then right here on the edges, what I've been doing is adding little supports to all these builds, almost like the this thing was going to collapse if it didn't do it like this. Uh, so pretty much is something like this all the way around is adding little bits of elevated support uh let's see maybe something like this here something like that maybe let's do a little bomb bomb like this here on the edges like that you don't even have to do it something like that super simple uh over here we could do a little more maybe something like this that kind of goes uh tears up a little bit like that maybe with a little stair and then here on this side maybe a little more something like this this that that and that that goes kind of wrap around around here the side like that there we go something like that maybe boom there we go and then oh what was that as i say uh, and then maybe even adding a little bit of a gravel path around here like the broken blocks coming down maybe something like that something like that around the edges you can even add a little bit of bush to add some life right there look how cool i love this okay Maybe a little more bush here wrapped around. Take that little piece out. There we go. And maybe even drop it right there. Oh, that looks good. That looks good. Uh, over here, I don't know if I want to add maybe just a little bit of bush right here. And maybe a little extra added little thing thing like that. Oh, that's perfect. Maybe a little more right here. There we go. And that's it. That's pretty much it. Look at that. Oh, man. How do, what do you guys think? I love the way this one came out. So, so cool. We're still keeping the themes about uh, the little broken areas around the side. Totally matching the aesthetic of this whole area. And I love that roof. That roof with that. Oh, that looks so cool. I don't want to go too crazy adding more details to that roof. That's pretty good. Uh, but, man, I love it. Let's take one more little spin. We did an interior, too. Hopefully, you guys did enjoy this one. I love this area this style is looking very nice we're going to be upgrading all these let me know what you guys think what should we be adding to this area what should we do a little barn a little stable we should add a, a little keep yes 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 all three what, what do you want to see next let me know in the comment section uh but i'm out of here for now uh thank you everybody for watching and i will catch you on the next episode of building with sausage see you guys later all right goodbye what did i just break all those okay <laughs> bye bye <laughs>